<laughs> so everybody just a little quick update on how I'm doing on day four and um, it's really in the last four days I've eaten three days of just fruit only and yesterday I included some raw foods because I got sort of cravings I think it's because the cold has me detoxing a bit more um, so yeah the two previous days was only all fruits eaten and today but well, yesterday I threw in some salad and a little bit of mild enough raw chocolate and I also had like a tiny little sample of some some vegan soup that I just got as well like a little sample a small amount <laughs> One of those days, but you know, I don't really care because I've no label. But the fact it was such a small amount and it's uniform liquid, I don't really, don't really give a poop. I don't care too much. And you know, if in the past if I did that, I'd probably just get wild cravings and then go off the, go off the, the <laughs> go off the the wallet. What was gonna say? Go off the wall. Go off the the bullet. Go go wild. <laughs> just wanting more and more and more. Um, cooked food and stuff but luckily that's not the way I'm like anymore because of the path that I've been walking just gradually improving but this today I just want to say like how I've been doing and today I just feel just feeling brilliant like I went to the happy prayer today which is like a lovely shop and uh, my favorite store and um, sort of has raw food cooked food and um, vegan food mostly vegan vegan drinks it's just the people there who work there and the people who own the shop, just the customers, just very, very lovely atmosphere. I really like the place, you know. It's very, it's like my, my pub, my local place to hang out and talk to friends and just socialise, kind of. So I did a cliff walk, which is, I don't know how many kilometres that is, like five kilometres or something, there, and then I go to the happy prayer and then I come back again. But I noticed today a lot, like, because I just say fruits, when I went to the happy pear, by the way, that's why I mentioned happy pear. I just ate oranges. I ate five big oranges. That's what I bought. And just a glass of water, that's all. And I had fantastic energy walking back then after that on the cliff walk. Like, I just, I was zooming along, even though I had, like, a, a bag which, with me on my back that was, like, fairly, like, heavyish or had more stuff, at least, heavier than walking there. Um, I definitely, my nose drained a lot, and I just had a really, really clear nose. And even now, you know, I just sneezed a little bit. I'm just like clearing through my nose. And partially that's because I have a cold, a very minor cold, you know. This cold hasn't gotten me much at all, actually, this time. But one thing I noticed, everybody, is I'm not eating enough calories the last four days. So usually I stop eating maybe between like eight and half, eight and nine, maybe something like that. But it's like... Today at 11, just it's quarter past 11 now. I just wanted to eat stuff, so I had an orange and I just thought, I think I want something like more. Like, so I have some bananas that I bought, organic bananas I bought at the Happy Bear. So I just got three or something and blended it with water, made banana milk. It's so delicious when you blend bananas. There's something about blending with water, so, so, mm, it just enhances the flavor for me for some reason. Um, but that said, like I like to eat bananas too and chew it very, very effectively so it becomes a creamy smoothie in your mouth. And don't forget when you have an orange and you, you, you chew it, that's your natural juicer and you can spit out the pulp if you want. And I know people who do that. Or you could eat some and spit out some. It could be like half solid orange, half juice. You don't always necessarily need a machine is what I'm saying. And your mouth is the best juicer and the best smoothie maker. At least for soft stuff like fruits, obviously. <laughs> Not going to be plowing through bamboo sticks. Or <laughs> but I would set them in the best juicer and blender. <laughs> but other than that, everyone had just overall feeling excellent. Like, this is the best cold I've ever had in my life. I'm just like full of energy. Like, not always, but just feeling very good. Bell movements, yeah, definitely. Like the oranges are definitely like definitely pulling a GI tract. They're they're like they're similar to a herbal formula for your for your GI tract. Just mono eating oranges. The natural acidity. Um, yeah, you shouldn't brush your teeth for like maybe forty minutes after eating citrus or acid stuff or apple cider vinegar, for example. Because it weakens a very thin layer of your enamel. Which is an okay, an okay process, but you shouldn't start going wild brushing your teeth then. So everyone, that's my update for today. Highly recommend joining in. It's just phenomenal.
just my mood has been way better overall just my energy has been fantastic my sleep has been deeper I'm way happier overall if you know what i mean like just better vibe um yeah um so yeah i hope this video helps check out my last video check out my next videos follow follow while i'm up to i did five months 99 to 100% raw now i want to do as much as possible like, like the same just fruits with optional occasional juices with optional um occasional like i definitely will be taking some herbs for sure because i love herbs and you can see my favorite herbs li listed in the link uh, below this video which i suggest or recommend um i think the herbs have helped my immune system and just i don't know even my mom keeps saying saying to me like oh yeah you're like handling this cold very very well I have to say but of course she says it in a woman's voice not my my manly voice but yeah i think that's all i really want to say everybody i uh, hope you have a lovely day and don't forget to click the subscribe and the notification bell button otherwise you won't receive notifications uh, future videos on holistic living, body, mind, spirit, relationships, healing, empowerment, cleansing, fasting, herbs, all sorts of awesome stuff. Again, thanks for watching and for your time. And um, yeah, I wish you a lovely day. And thanks for sharing if you share. And what are your experiences on um, fruit feasting and raw food eating? Do you feel better? Do you get inspired to go back once you've tasted the golden nugget? It's hard to go back, isn't it? When you taste something so good. That's been the way for, it has been for me. Okay, have a lovely day. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go.